Hello, y'all. It's your girl, Shamira. Welcome to my channel. If you're new here, please subscribe. And I'm going to talk about my lock method for this flat twist out. Which um, I did have this flat twist in for, let me see, uh, four days. Just because it was raining, it was snowing, it was doing a bunch of different stuff. And my hair reacts to the weather immediately. Any little bit of rain, a little bit of snow, a little bit of humidity, I got a big poof. And, you know, it defeats the purpose of trying to achieve a twist out. Um, so these are the results. And I'm going to hop right into it about the products I use. So I use a lock method, of course, which is L for liquid or leave-in, O for oil, C for cream. So the leave-in I use is a staple of mine, Shea Moisture, Raw Shea Butter Restorative Conditioner um, for dry damaged hair. Um, this can be used as a washout conditioner or, or, or leave-in. So I use it as a leave-in and I love it. Like I, I can't even begin to say how much I love this. This will always be a staple of mine. It makes moisturize my hair, makes my hair soft, it, I don't want to say it defines, but this is Bay. Like, I don't, I don't even know. I can't begin to talk about like how much I love this. Like, I just know that whenever I use this with whatever product I use it with, I'm going to be winning. Like this moisturizes it everything and all natural ingredients. One thing I can say that it doesn't really do is shine. I don't really look for Shea Moisture products to shine. I've never experienced that with them um, too much, maybe a little bit, but not like, wow. So, but th this is definitely a staple and I feel like you can use it um, a, a little bit goes a long way. So I usually in for each section, I'll put, I'm heavy handed. So you can really just use one pump, like one push down and, um, but I usually use two for each section. So that's that. And the oil is Shea Moisture. 100% coconut oil. And if you've been watching my YouTube channels and my lock method videos, I know you're tired of hearing this. It is finally empty. So that's it for this. Um, if it's not so, I'll purchase again, but I, I kind of like using new products to see how they are. And I do mix it with other oils, um, but this is a good oil. Like I would definitely use this. It is lightweight, but moisturizing and gets the job done. So this is the oil I use and I really liked it. So the cream is Mayel Organics Babasu Brazilian Curl Cocktail Curl Cream. Hopefully I pronounced that right for dry and curly hair types. Okay, so all natural ingredients also no parabens, no sulfates, no paraffins, no mineral oil, no synthetic colors, no DEA, no animal testing. Well, one that I, one thing that stood out is a smell. Like the smell is very, I don't know. I don't know what ingredient that makes it smell. It's kind of like a candy, like a fruit, like a, I'm trying to look at the ingredients list to see if anything will pop out to me of the smell that it has, but it's like a, not mango, it's kind of like a some citrus, grapefruit, is it grapefruit? Which I don't like grapefruit. I think it's like a close to a grapefruit smell. Yeah, I think it smells like grapefruit. This is, is grapefruit in here? I finally got, I've been trying to figure out because, and the smell does linger but not in an intrusive way not where you feel like you have to wash your hair or anything like that but i've been trying to figure out like what does this smell like why do i keep smelling it but not figuring out what it smells and i think it smells like grapefruit so that's good to know so let's get into like how i like it so i really like this and like the way it just went on my hair 
the I don't know the consistency like I just feel like everything was just just right like you like it went into my hair smoothly it um, provided a, a little bit of de definition which is great like I curl cream is true to its name like it does provide a bit of curl um, it is like a good cream like not too thick not too thin great consistency I really like this like I feel like this would be um, um, a staple of mine like I would definitely purchase this again and with the sales that they got have going on like I think I bought this for when they have they, their five dollar sale um but yeah really really good I don't know the original price but I, I believe I paid five dollars for this um I really love it though but just be be careful with the smell that's the only thing that I would say um it lingers um after four days of being in twists, when I unraveled my flat twist, I smelt it a little bit, but I no longer smell it anymore. But while it was in the flat twist, I did smell it. Um, and lastly, always have to put a gel on my hair because my goal is definitely definition. Like, that's what I love. Um, so the gel is our custard is Miss Jessie's Coily Custard. Um... So no petroleum, no parabens, no sulfates, no artificial color, colors, no mineral oil, um, no animal testing. Basically all natural ingredients, which I definitely do love. Um, and this says it's for transforming frizzy fro to define curly cues, wash and go styling, fighting curl shrinkage, rod sets, daily curl refresher. Okay, what I do like about this is I tend to like... And I didn't show you the consistency of anything else. I'm slacking, but I'm going to show you the consistency of this. Um, I like gels and custards with that liquidy, like, kind of gel consistency and not as thick. Um, not that I'm against it. I just prefer it to be a little thinner. Um, let's see. Like, you see how it just kind of runs? I prefer my gels to do, to do that. Just because I feel like it gets to every strand, like I like it. Um, I was really surprised by the um, how it applied. Like it goes on so smoothly. Um, does not feel like a gel when you when it, you're applying it. Um, kind of like a soap, like a natural soap kind of smell. Yeah. But not not a bad smell. Um, but I, I love this. I was really surprised. This is maybe my second time using this. I was one. I also had a couple of surprises. Um, one that it was all natural ingredients because when I checked the other Miss Jessie's custards and uh, multicultural and all the cute little names that they have, they have like a silicone in there. So I'm like, I completely don't use silicones or anything like that. Um, that's just me. I prefer not to. Um, and they all had it except this one. So I was like, that's interesting. But, um, that's one. Two, even though it's a fine, like, do you see like the value? This is, this is first day hair. It's been in four, four days in flat twist, but this is first day hair that I unraveled it and look at the the definition. Do you see that? Like it has definition and volume. Like you, you really got to love that, you know, and that's one thing. Um, I use this, I think once before and it I had the same results with all different products. And I really love this. Like, I feel like this will definitely be a staple of mine as well. Um, one con is that I believe which the price is not on here. This is like seventeen, nineteen dollars. Well, why? Like, why? Why is this so much? It is eight point five ounces. Seventeen, eighteen dollars. Why? Like that makes me sad. But it's an amazing product, a must-have. So that was the consistency of that. Just to show you um, the consistency of the cream really quickly. 
Like, do you see that? Like, that's perfect. Not too thick, not too thin, just will apply smoothly to your hair. Love it. Um, and this is much thicker than that. So I'm not going to open it up just because I'm going to have to bang it to reaches the bottom. But as you can see, it's not going to the bottom. So that's how thick it is. It is thick. And I do believe that is for thicker uh, textures. But I, I would not um, shy away from trying it if my hair was thinner. So, so yeah, that is my lock method for this week. Um, please leave comments below about um, any suggestions. And follow me on Instagram, hhj underscore mommy and daughter, where I will... Uh, Post the exact pictures of all these products as well. And please, thank you for watching. You guys are awesome. And I will see you next time. Bye.